the deadliest outbreak on record. An unprecedented crisis. They're trying to come up with a vaccine. Over the next 30 years, that number could triple. There are so many big problems in the world. You only have one perspective, then you're not going to solve the problems of today. They're too big. The more people that we have looking at a problem, we're going to be able to attack that problem better. Diversity in science is absolutely critical because we don't all think the same. We need ideas from men, women, every race, every color. We're going to need everybody. We're definitely going to need all hands on deck. When you have all hands on deck, when people really come together, then it can really affect the whole world and change the whole world for the better. HHMI is funding the Hannah Gray Fellows Program because we want to find the best solutions, and the best solutions will be found by a diverse set of people. This program supports four years of postdoctoral training, followed by four more years as a faculty member at a research university. We named this program after a really inspirational woman who was one of the founding trustees of the Howard Hughes Medical Institute. And because of her prominence as a female leader in academia. I was in a undergrad chemistry program. I was one of two African-American females in the entire department. There weren't a lot of people that looked like me that were in science. It's intimidating and a lot of the time you can easily be overlooked. My research involves mitochondria, which are the powerhouse of the cell, and how they're regulated in neurons. I'm hoping that that basic understanding can be then used to help develop different therapeutic options to treat diseases like Parkinson's disease, Alzheimer's disease, and ALS. Being a Hannah Gray Fellow, it's very important to have a mentor Women like Chantel will be the absolute role model to bring more young women into science and to see that this is a career that they could succeed at, that they can thrive at. As a structural biologist, I want to look at how proteins interact. And so we can understand these interactions between proteins, then that can help us design better therapeutics. Christopher immediately solved several crystal structures, which is a major feat. I don't think anyone else has ever solved two structures in this short of a time. The major goal for HIV is to have a vaccine. What I'm going to focus on in my research is actually trying to reassemble a complex of HIV with the host cell receptors and try to capture that snapshot in time, which will reveal a number of possibly new targets that we can then design new therapies for. Science is hard. And in general, the answers tend to come from places we have no idea where they're coming from. They're just out of left field. I take care of colonies of fruit flies actually going in with electrodes and recording from the electrical signals inside a single neuron within the fruit fly's brain. I want to understand how voltage-gated ion channels transform the signal within a neuron to allow us to think. This fellowship is really precious because it gives people security and resources and allows them to take on risks they wouldn't take on otherwise. Being a Hannah Gray Fellow is this is going to provide me support through what can be quite a hard transition from postdoctoral researcher, which I am right now, towards starting my own lab and actually becoming a principal investigator. At HHMI, we feel it's really important to use the resources of the Institute and not just money but our ability to embed these young people in a scientific community that really is known for excellence. The Hannah Gray Fellows Program was, is really important because that allowed people like me to have my own funding and hopefully you know, motivate others to stay in science. Howard Hughes Medical Institute is committed to supporting scientists who will solve some of the greatest problems in science. And to do this, we need all people involved in science, people from all backgrounds, to help us solve these great problems.